and here we are going in the uh, front door through the uh, storm door and let me show you a neat little thing. This is called a vanishing screen. Okay, this is just the uh, front uh, plate, the glass, and we come inside if we want ventilation. Then we roll the screen down. We have almost a full view glass door. But with this little trick, the vanishing screen, we can also have screen and regular ventilation if we want to have open windows and doors and yet privacy. And this has lock and key and a deadbolt, so you have good security even when your door is uh, uh, ventilating with just fresh air. We come into this uh, little cottage and we have nice vaulted ceiling to give us the feeling of space. But you will notice we have transoms and small windows. This is for privacy and security and the ability to arrange your furniture most of however you would like in the space that you have. It get, lets you be first, uh, more versatile with your arrangements. I have a nice little um, kitchen cabinet arrangement here and a little bar. And this is called a mini pantry. Uh, and the door opens and you have any number of pull-out drawers for canned goods, uh, packaged goods. This is a different drawer. So that you actually have uh, a little mini pantry, very well arranged with drawers. And then you have your uh, kitchen cabinets here above and below. This is a new smooth top uh, electric range. Uh, new uh, vent fan there, uh, new lights in here, and uh, this is a new kitchen sink, new uh, faucets and so forth, new garbage disposal. And this is Staron, S-T-A-R-O-N, solid surface countertops, and these are 100% um, acrylic, and we provide you a nice, this is called uh, a repair sheet, it comes from where the sink was cut out. And if you should have uh, some kind of mishap, you've broken it, cracked it, use a chainsaw, they come and cut you out a repair piece. When they get through, you are completely solid and smooth again. You don't have any lines or signs where you've had a terrible mishap. And here we have space for a refrigerator. We do not have a refrigerator because there's so many choices and styles. We were advised not to put a refrigerator, but have it as a negotiable item. And of course, it is plumbed for an ice maker. Uh, here we have the uh, washer dryer area uh, with nice cabinets above, uh, well lit. And um, plenty of uh, enclosed uh, cabinet shelving here. Fluorescent lighting, of course, for good lighting and uh, energy efficient. Uh, this is, I guess you would say, this is a little uh, dining uh, nook here. And this is, uh, you know, living, dining, uh, den, uh, just livable space here. And we come on down to the uh, hall bathroom. And here in the hall bathroom, we have it so that it services company in the live and dining area, but also there is a door here to the other to the uh, other bedroom, so that you have really good access. If you have company, then uh, your company has the privacy of their bedroom and bathroom to themselves. But you also have here uh, a closet for uh, for towels or storage or whatever, and below is the hot water heater. This is cultured, cultured marble, solid surface, and uh, a new towel bar for uh, toilet paper holders and things like that. And we come on down to the uh, guest bedroom, and here we have the guest bedroom and a nice uh, walk-in closet with uh, fixed shelving. is a nice side bedroom because it has a, a, a lighting fan. 
Back here in the master bedroom, we have cathedral still in the game, and you'll notice we have transoms again for privacy, furniture arrangement, but then a nice uh, window here that uh, is behind the privacy fence, uh, and also uh, you see these beautiful, beautiful trees here. Have a nice walk-in closet with built-in shelves. There's actually a small floored area in the attic. There's also a light up there, but you do need a step ladder to get up there to that. Here's the master bath, small but uh, certainly functional and well done. Caught saw, uh, cultured marble countertop, uh, nice little cabinet over the commode, tub shower arrangements. Both bathrooms have uh, new ceramic tile flooring. Then we'll come on through to the backyard which, where we were earlier, but you'll see how the master bedroom opens right off onto the pat porch and patio area for a nice area, and of course all of this behind the privacy fence, so you have security and privacy, and this uh, backs right up to uh, Sea Island Property Company. Sea Island Company, our natural, beautiful, beautiful wood. Hope you've enjoyed the tour of Little 427 here on St. Simons. I always enjoy coming and showing it and hope you'll come visit. Maybe you'll buy. Thank you.